I've been doing all right. Just gonna get it started. <clears throat> Play the theme song for the day. Get away from me. If I was you, I'd watch what you say to me. Snakes all in my bed, wanna lay with me. This ain't no motherfucking game, why you play with me? Don't play with me, this the only thing I love. I love, 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 love. I love, 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 oh love, I love. I love, 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 love. I love, you play with me, that's the only thing. I love, I love, love, love. I love, 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 I love, 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 I 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 love, I'm not your friend, I'm your enemy. Mm. I don't know what's got an enemy. enemy. Lately, I'm just feeling finicky. Lately, I just want the cake and the greatest amenities. Lately, I ain't got no sympathy. Aim at the industry. This ain't the way that they push me. Push your identity. I got some line in the mouth. I keep my nine in the trunk. Right. All the young niggas gon' bleed. Please. Guess it's that time of the month. Please. I done came up from the mud. They said I'd never be none. They said I'd never be rich. They said I'd never be anything. I told them, get off my dick. Get away from me. If I was you, I'd watch what you say to me. Snakes all in my bed, won't lay with me. Say no motherfucker, why you play with me? Don't play with me, this the only thing I love. I love, 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 love. I love, I love, 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 love. I love, I love, 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 love. I love, don't play with me, this the only thing I love. I love, 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 love. For no hell, money ain't everything. Nigga, speak for yourself. Hey. One shots every week. Scrape the chains, pay the bills. Yo. Rainy days come sleep. Oh, yeah. Now I sleep with my girls. I wanted to be like low. Hey, I'm living to be like low. Uh. You just wanna ride my way. You ain't never seen my boat. Uh. I don't want the east side smoke. I'ma tell everyone I'm a GI Joe. How to my weapons, I let my Levi's go. If I think of a pimpin', you'll probably be my mom. I need some different opponents. Yeah. I think I live in the moment. Yeah. My bitch in the morning. I, I take, take that shit when I want, I want it. it. Why you new niggas be frying? You just be lying. I keep it three hundred. Came up for nothing. I say what I wanted. No aim and discussion. I aim and I bitch. Get away from me. If I was you, I'd watch what you say to me. Snakes all in my bed. Wanna lay with me? Say no motherfucking. Why you play with me? Don't play with me. That's the only thing I love. I love, 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 love. I love, 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 love. I love, 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 love. Yeah, so what's good, family? Peace to the gods. How everybody doing? Uh, 
as you see the title, I ain't going to keep y'all alone. As you see the title, don't burn down your house trying to build a church. You feel me? Uh, some of us, you know, you know, we get into this thing like like OG Oreo say, man, we, we want to share this knowledge with everybody, right? We want to wake everybody up. We want to, you know, reach out to our people and let them know what's going on. And uh, everybody, this stuff ain't for everybody, right? It's not for everybody. And um, once you understand that, it, it frees you up. You know what I'm talking about? It really frees you up on another level. So, um, man, the last experience I had, man, probably going to be the last time I, you know, smoked DMT because it showed me, you know, that consciousness is really dead. You know what I'm talking about? Like, love is really dead. Family is really dead. The world is really dead. You know, we talk about this, this place is an illusion. But one thing about it is that this illusion, it seems so real. That what makes it, you know, keeps it going. That this illusion seems so real, you know what I'm saying? And when I came back from the trip, I was like, man, like, is this really deep and to the point where you just got to accept it for what it is? It's time for a new wave, right? It's time for a new new way of thinking going into this new world. A lot of people going to be still thinking the same way and they'll get get trapped in a loop like like my brother was talking about earlier. Um when I got my last reading that I was talking about the other week. And it, it was just confirmation of, okay, I'm going through these loops. So every time it's, I'm going through the same things year after year, year after year, regardless of what's going on. So I, I got to break out the loop that I've been going through year after year, year after year. Um, once you master the matrix, you basically become what they call Satan, right? And it's deep, but it's really not that deep once you understand why all these different things going down like it is. You know, all the chaos. All the madness. I can't step outside without, you know what I'm saying, running into a pseudo human, right? A fake human. They 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 run off of fear. They run off their lower chakras. But as the post I showed yesterday, narrow is the path. If you stay stuck in your lower chakras, that's that's the destruction. That's the destruction. So you got to raise up to your third eye. Eventually, you got to raise up to your third eye. You know, uh, most people won't because they love this world. You know what I'm saying? They really love this world. And they hate to see the world going through what it's going through. But like I was saying, this illusion seems so real and we get caught up into it. And it's hard trying to balance living here and living in the higher realm, right? So what the DMT showed me is all of this stuff is dead, man. Um, ain't nothing else to be much said, you know. Really ain't no more videos that I can share. You know, ain't really nothing new that I can share with you until I elevate to the next level as well. Until the world wake up to the next level and 
we start a new wave of consciousness, a new way of thinking, a new way of seeing things. And so, man, I just, I love the experience and that was my last one, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm already done, I done let go the weed, I done let go the alcohol, I done let go the mere fact that love is not, you know, we don't know love how we should. You know, we only know the love that they they presented to us and showed us. And we got to learn how to go within and start creating all these things through the heart chakra, through the throat chakra, through the third eye and through the crown chakra. Until then, this shit going to stay shut down. And it's really not shut down as I see it, because I can still do, you know, go outside, do what I want to do. But most of the people that's, that's, that's being controlled by fear, they scared to come out the house, right? You know, uh, the area I'm in, I see a lot of people just, uh, they'll come outside with their dogs and whatnot, and then they go right back in the house. But they looking at me like, why he's sitting outside, you know, I'm soaking up more information, up, you know, from the sun, you know, um, and they trying to block the sun, right? They know it's, it's going to be a hot summer. It's going to be a real hot one, you know, regardless of how much they try to block, block this new energy coming in and... A lot of us feel it, you know. Uh, so they can't. They can, they can only hold us back for so long, right? Like they can only hide me, hide my videos so long. Like I post my videos, I share my knowledge, and I, you know, share my different perspectives. But it's only my perspectives. But they know who I am. I post every time, you know, and I only get a few. few Fruit views on YouTube and fruit views on here, and I'm cool with that because this is this is not for everybody, you know. This is only for the gods that's that's waking up, and we say we say God, but what is a God? What is you know what is a God, right? A God, God is man awoken, and man is God sleep. So, so many people, they, 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 you know, they trying to convince people that God's not dead, right? Well, eventually, you know, they are, they going to have to, you know, come to their own awakening. If they don't, then they going to stay asleep. And that's what, that's what a man is. A man is God sleep within, and a God is man awaken. You know, uh, man, I was running it with a with a man, a real cool sister, right, the other night, and we was just basically sharing, you know, sharing different books we read, and um, and basically, you know, talking about spirituality, and I was like. You know what I'm saying? This this what I always been wanting, right? A, a a goddess, right? A woman that's really on the on the path, not a woman that's you know on, of this world, you know that can't see past the illusion. So it's it's beautiful, you know what I'm saying? To reach out and connect with people that's really on the path, and it you know when I first got onto this thing, like I said sharing videos it was only me you know what i'm saying and then uh somewhere out the blue you know cuz old tony came out of nowhere and i was like damn there go somebody that's on the shit because when i first got on it i thought i was the only one listening to uncle bobby and brother panic now you know coming from the background i came from and it was kind of hard and so eventually you know i started um started attracting a soul family and um 
to all the new people, I appreciate the shares and all that. But remember, you know, this stuff ain't for everybody. We ain't here to convert nobody over, you know, just share the knowledge. If they, they, they you know, take it in, then it's for them. If they don't, then, you know, they still vibrating at the lower chakras, you know. They only know fear and what they're going to eat and, you know, getting on the Internet and flexing, right? And trying to, you know, throw shade every day, you know. Um, so like, like cuz old Tony said, man, some of us really need to go back to church because we get up into this consciousness for the wrong things. We're not here to save nobody. We only here to share the knowledge. And as Uncle Bobby say, take it or leave it, you know what I'm saying? I'm not here to uh, change nobody's mind. But never burn down your house trying to build a church, right? We can't save everybody. You know, that's just a good, that's just the Christ inside of us, you know. We want to wake everybody up, the family and friends and, you know, the people that you love. But... Once they see you really serious about it, they'll make their mind up, you know what I'm saying? But all of this shit is dead. Love is is, is dead, you know, because everybody has some kind of condition. And love is supposed to be unconditional, you know, it's supposed to be genuine. And... We have been taught so many lies and taught so many uh taught so many wrong things until we thinking like the white man. But as uh Dr. Phil said, they know that the world will not last long as we thinking like them. It's over. You know. That's why they, they doing what they doing. But they have no power but fear. They have no power but fear. And so I just wanted to come online today and just speak for a little minute because I'm, you know, I'm going to take me a little break and reevaluate things. And uh, But the videos, like I said, they there, you know, they there. Um but it's time to understand that all of this stuff is, 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 the energy is dying out. And once we accept that for what it is, go within and start searching for our own answers. Start, you know, the, the new normal, as Ken Billion say, the new normal. Until then, we're going to keep seeing the madness. We're going to keep trying to figure this thing out. It's nothing to figure out. It's already done. You know, it's already been written that it's going to come to a time where we got to go to the next dimension. But it starts with the mind and it starts with the heart. And I love it. You know, I love, I love this. I've been on this path for going on three years and it's been it's been a journey, right? Lost a lot of lost a lot of people, you know. Well they really lost me because cause they couldn't understand me, you know, they tried to control how I think and how I see things. I can see, you know, how I can view things and view other people's perspective, but it's kinda hard when they not on a path. So when I was chopping it up with the sister the other night and she was just sharing me all her knowledge, she was like, man, put me on. I know you know some more stuff. And I was like, you know, you can read as many as books as you want, but you got to take that knowledge and, and you got to become the book. You got to become these books that you read and these videos that you watch and these lectures that you you know, listening to. And so, yeah, it's only, it, we, we, it's only something greater coming and everybody ain't gonna understand it, it, you know. And that's cool. I accept it for what it is. I love my people, but I love the soul family more, you know. 
because we really want to change. We really want to better ourselves to become who we truly are. So, yeah, man, I just wanted to speak on that uh, for this Transformation Sunday. You know, everybody ain't ain't willing to change. Everybody ain't willing to raise their frequency up and become who they are, shine their light. You know, they say, you know, the sun is on lockdown too, but we gotta understand that sun is a representation of you. And so when we going through grief, when we going through fear, we, we blocking the sun. That's what they don't want to tell us. When we stand in the house, we making the sun not shine. Um, so we got to just step up to our power and realize who we truly are. And just back away, you know, back away for a little bit from the distractions. You know, I know, you know, we're all these different celebrities throwing little live concerts and stuff. Uh, I love music, right? But even the music is dead. You know, when you got somebody like <laughs> 6 9 just come out of nowhere and blows up off of one video. I forgot how many views he got on the video, but he ain't got a rap no more. You know, he, basically I'm telling you, he ain't got a rap no more just off of that one video that he just dropped. Because of all the views he got. And so, we got to stop making these, these, these people famous. We got to stop giving them our energy. Energy vampires. They take our energy and go about their life and do what the hell they want. And they don't really care about you. They show that, right? And so... So many distractions, so much stuff going on. We can speak on it for hours and hours. But we got to realize what's going on on the outside is going on inside of us. So forget group think unless it's somebody on your frequency. If they ain't on your frequency, they going to drain your energy fast. Believe me. I, I witnessed it this year, you know. You can only do so much for so much, man. You can only do so much for people, you know, until they make up in their mind, you know, they going to get on the wave or not. Or they could just, like Tony say, go back to the church. So don't burn down your house trying to build a church. Can't save everybody. You can only save yourself, right? So many people get into it for the wrong reasons, you know? I tell you how many people come on my page and never like anything, never share anything, but they can take my quotes and take all the stuff from the page and act like, you know, they, they you know, they got all the knowledge, you know, and it's cool, I don't, you know, but I see it, and I, and that's why I'm speaking on this today, because some people get into it for the wrong reasons. I got into this spiritual thing, been on it all my life, like I said, until I just fully got serious about it, and that's when I started having more powerful experiences than the ones that I was having in church when I was in the church. And it and it showed me how powerful the soul is. It showed me how powerful the soul is. And I ain't gonna lie, it scared me. You know, once I raised that energy up to my crown chakra and just felt it, it was like I was about to explode, right? So, um, we got to get on the frequency and just keep going. Whatever you feel like you need, do it. But eventually, it's going to run out. 
And that's what the DMT was showing me the other the other day. Like you got the power, you you can you know, you got the power inside of you. You ain't gotta keep doing this. And I was like, okay. You know, and then that's when the other the other night I was in my dream smoking the DMT and it was like, okay, I see I I got the revelation, like, you know, we can keep going and searching for it these things that's outside of us, but the power is really within us. Until we believe it, then we won't raise up to that 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 frequency. And it saved me from a lot of reincarnations as well, you know. A lot of reincarnations that I had coming up, but it, it freed me from all of that. It showed me, man, everything is within. Know thyself before you try to know anybody else, right? Very powerful. And that's why I wanted to share that today. Um, it's going to be all right, you know what I'm saying? No matter how crazy this thing get, you got to create your happy ending. You know, you got to create your happy ending. And that's what it basically showed me. Um, and that's about it, family. I mean, the, the path, life goes on, right? It just goes on, regardless of what going on all around the world. It keeps going. No matter how many people make their transition and go home, we still here for a reason. You know, the biggest motivation for me this year was Mike Tyson coming back out of the blue. Say he back. Say the, the, the guards of war told him to come back. And so it's time for all of us to, to wake up and come back to who we truly are, no matter what we've been through. And so that's why I was like, man, if Mike Tyson can come back after all he been through, you know, married old girl for what, two weeks? And then she divorced him for 11 million. You know what I'm saying? And all the other stuff, you know what I'm saying? So it's time for us to raise up and zone in to what we really want to do. You know, um, it's very important that we do it. So do whatever you got to do to to figure out it ain't nothing to figure out really do what you got to do to make up your mind whatever you been wanting to do because we ain't got forever on this planet it's been written that it's going to be a new heaven and a new earth why because this life was never meant to last forever you know it's a brutal illusion. It seems real. It seems so real, right? And if we get lost in the matrix instead of trying to master the matrix like Neo did, then we're just another regular human being. The, the divine soul in you is ready for the next level. We've been, I've been down here too long too long <laughs> and I done learned my lessons and I understand now that the power is within we can search all we want all day but the power is within until we believe it we won't see the power we won't be the power and that's basically what I wanted to touch on I said I ain't want to uh, stay on here an hour today just wanted to touch about 30 minutes and we almost at that mark so yeah family peace to the god stay woke you know don't don't fall back to sleep when this shit is over you know what i'm saying uh don't fall back to sleep when all this thing is over and like i said no matter how crazy it get you gotta create your happy ending it was meant for us to create happy endings.
And that's why they putting all of the fear in front of us. Every every other week is something new. What's going to be this week, you know? Uh, like I said, they was talking about how the sun be getting on lockdown too. They'll tell you whatever they, they want to tell you to get you to believe it. Because they know who we truly are. They know we run this thing, as Uncle Bobby say. They know we run this thing. And so, we at war with ourselves by what the things we looking at, by the things we listening to, and how we speaking every day, how we wake up in the morning and move throughout our day. So, learn how to master your mind, your heart. Don't let anybody tell you whatever. Don't even take for what I say. You know what I'm saying? Talk to yourself and understand that you are the creator. You are the creator. Until you believe that, they're going to keep playing games with us on the fear side of things. So, yeah, family. Hope y'all had a good weekend. You know, stay vigilant. Stay vigilant on what you what you looking at and what you listening to and what you posting. Because what you posting is who you are too. You attract that right back to you. So no more oppression and no more people doing you wrong. No more they, they killing us. No more of the drama. You know, share the knowledge. Share you know, share the knowledge. But some things we have to learn to keep to ourselves and everything going to work out. So, yeah, man, stay motivated. Keep doing your magic, whatever that is. So, you already know you the one. Peace, family.